so today um, Coles and Woolworths workers are coming together uh, to undertake our first national strike. We're striking for a living wage, safer workplaces and more secure jobs, particularly for the casual workers. Coles needs to listen to us more, give us a go with bargaining. Um, I'm here in solidarity with um, Rafu workers. I used to work in the retail sector and I know I have a pretty good experience of what it used to be like. This has been a long time in the making. Um, conditions at Coles and Woolworths have been slowly deteriorating over a number of years. I'm here today not just for myself, I'm here for the future of us Australians and those to come. We have um, come together to say enough is enough, it's time to stand up and so what you're seeing is the beginning of a movement to affect change at Coles and Woolworths. At a time when they have recorded billions in profit, they turn to our request of a raise in the minimum wage to $29 and laugh in our face as if that is ridiculous. I think instead we should laugh at their greed, which is ridiculous. The supermarkets in this country wield so much power and have been making obscene profits off of the back of workers. People that were labelled heroes during the pandemic, people that were frontline workers during the pandemic, that we all were told were so important to our economy and now the supermarkets are trying to take them for a ride. People that work in retail and hospitality, including Coles and Woolies workers, deserve fair wages, fair conditions, and deserve to be respected and recognised for the contribution, the essential work that they make to our society and to our economy. And there's a lot of scared people out there, but I think that from today's campaign, what you're going to see is that workers are going to realise there's not so much to be afraid of, that this is protected industrial action and that the boss cannot do much as we work towards securing a living wage, safer workplaces and more secure jobs. What you are doing is a remarkable achievement. It is a remarkable achievement. And it's not only important for your own wages, your own conditions and your own dignity. What you are doing is important for the entire trade union movement in this country. It begins the process of rebuilding a fighting union movement because what you are doing is what unionism is about and has always been about. RAFU might be a small union, but the big union is part of the establishment and conditions have been woeful. There has been no change. So I only think RAFU is going to grow because the only way to effect change is to join RAFU. With all great change begins first few steps and first small chisels, and with small roars can echo into loud ones. With the united people, we can achieve anything. We are the many, they are the few.